Hi, it's Janine and I thought I would do a video update of where I'm at in terms of physical healing. The last video I made about this was just after I'd had a very severe reaction uh, which had included severe pain particularly in my left arm. My left arm was, was extremely inflamed and pretty much immobilized and I had flu-like symptoms. So that's, well, it's, I won't say it's normal, <laughs> but it is. it has occurred many times before and when I've had a severe chemical intolerance reaction. So that was in response to when I'd kind of gone all out I guess and just eaten whatever I wanted and had probably gone a little bit overboard but it was an interesting experience experiment in terms of whether my physical health conditions were pretty much purely just a stress response so a psychological thing or whether there was a physical element to it as well and obviously there is a physical element there too so it, it was a learning experience and normally what I would do when I have a severe reaction like that is I would very much pull back, go back into fear, uh, go back into my little safe box. So cut my diet right back to, to the basics of really safe foods for me and just try and avoid any unnecessary exposure to the chemicals that I have issues with. But this time I decided that I wanted to continue to move forward and I wasn't going to go back into fear and I was going to continue as much as possible to live how I wanted to live. And one thing that I really wanted to work on that was quite important to me was being able to eat the same meal at dinner time as my children. To start to get some normalcy there, normality there, both for my children and for myself, because I, I'm conscious that I, I don't want to, through my issues, also pass on that kind of trauma and worry and stress around food and eating to my children. So beginning to be able to eat with more normality around them is something that's quite important to me. So I've just been focusing on moving forward as much as possible, doing what I want to do, living the way I want to live, eating the foods that I want to eat and just really just trying to be in allowing and just opening up to being able to eat different foods and a lot of it is just letting go of the the programming I've given myself and it is that I've given myself of all the things that I can't eat and worry about that if I eat that then I will have that reaction or if I eat that then I will have that symptom or often if I eat that my skin will break out and I've built up just really layers upon layers of trauma and worry around particularly around what I eat. Uh, so I'm just working on, I'm just moving forward gently. So increasing the variety in my diet, trying as much as possible to just eat what I feel like eating instead of what I think I should be eating. Just releasing all that fear and that programming and, that, and it will take some time. I am aware that it will take some time to, to do that. But just trying to be easy with myself, gentle with myself. And I have a couple of mantras uh, when I'm eating, just thinking, just relax and enjoy it. So just 
just to relax and enjoy eating. It's all good. So relax, enjoy, it's all good. And the other thing I've been doing is continuing with the Viteco breathing and particularly doing that when I am eating to further reduce the physical stress response in my body and help me to calm down and let go of that fear and that stress that I normally feel when I eat. And we're moving forward. It's, it's quite exciting. I am getting better. I am eating a much greater variety of food now. I am, I've just ordered myself some new makeup, which is quite exciting because I haven't really been able to wear makeup for a very long time. Oh, just very, very basic kind of stuff. So I've just ordered some new makeup, so I'm quite excited to try that when it arrives in the mail. And I am getting better. My symptoms are certainly no worse than what they were when I was really restricting my diet and my lifestyle. So it's really nice to be able to, to be moving forward and uh, opening up my life really and being able to enjoy more things, more foods. You know, I, I enjoy, I'm really, yeah, as I said, I'm really looking forward to the idea of being able to wear some more makeup again. Not that I wear a huge amount of makeup, but it's nice to have that option. So, all good news really. Uh, quite exciting that healing is happening after four very long years. And a lot of that, I think, has been just the, the, the mental process of just letting that go. And for me, believing that healing is possible, believing that energetically my healing is al already a reality, that I am already well. And for me just, it, it is just a matter of letting go and aligning with source energy and feeling good and and in feeling good believing that I'm moving towards that wellness complete wellness which is awesome it's really exciting Yay! <laughs> so that's a wee update on where we're at uh, watch the space but at the moment the space is really good um, very very positive so as always Feel good and I will talk to you soon.